strawberry shortcake. And I'm almost finished trimming my Christmas tree. And a very nice tree it is. Ew! This is my sister, Apple Dumpling. Isn't she adorable? <laughs> She's just beginning to talk. Red wagon! Red wagon! Sounds like someone wants a new red wagon for Christmas. We lost our old one in the river fudge. I love Christmas. Actually, I love every day. But Christmas is one of my very favorites. And I really love Christmas shopping. This year, I'm going to make a list of my friends. So I'll remember to get presents for all of them. There's Angel Cake. Angel Cake is so artistic. She bakes cakes that are so beautiful, you don't want to eat them. But so yummy, just have to. It's going to be hard to find a special gift for Angel. I wonder what she wants. That's Orange Blossom. Orange is a wonderful gardener. She grows all kinds of things. Flowers, fruits, and she makes the juiciest juice. What can I give Orange that's as yummy and colorful as her very own garden? There's Ginger Snap. She's so creative and the best baker in the whole world. You should taste her cookies. How will I ever find a present for Ginger that's as deliciously delightful as her own creations? And I can never forget Huck. Huck is a real adventurer. He's always climbing or speeding past. Whoosh! On his skateboard. What on earth will I get Huck? Something fast? Something on wheels? It won't be easy thinking of a gift for him. Then there are my pets, of course. Custard my cat. Custard is a very special cat with a very special personality. It's going to be tough finding just the right present for someone who's so fussy. And Pupcake, my dog. Pupcake's very silly and lots of fun. What would he like? Something as funny and silly as he is? Please be careful, Pupcake. Clummy Santa, Clummy Claus, Candy King with jumping stuff. What should I get for my friends? Perhaps a sweater.
fizzy and very sugary. I'm not called the Sugar Plum Fairy for nothing. So, tell me how I can help you. I'm looking for a present for my friend Orange Blossom. Tell me about her. Excuse me, esteemed fairy, but why should she tell you about her? If you know a little about her, it makes it easier to find the gift she would like. I'll tell you what she would like. She'd love one of these fabulous saddles. But she doesn't even ride horses. And she's not a horse herself. We need to get Orange something that she will like. Something that is important to her. Who wouldn't want a saddle? Oh, honey, put yourself in Orange Blossom's place. Yes, yes, what kinds of things does she like to do? She's very fond of planting and gardening. And she likes every kind of fruit. She loves to make sugar plum cider. When she has sugar plums, then the sugar plum bush might be the ideal gift. Thanks so much. How much do I owe you? How about some luscious berries? They're out of season here. They're yours. Merry Christmas. Juicy. Very juicy. Maybe a little too juicy. Here we are at the candy cane lot. This is where we get a gift for Ginger Snap. And I know just the perfect gift for her. A lovely saddle. I don't know, honey. Maybe that would be the perfect gift for you. But I think Ginger would like something related to cookies. There sure are a lot of candy canes here. Not that that's a bad thing. Help! Huh? Did those candy canes say help? It sure sounded like help. Over here! Over here! Someone did speak. But who? Ever hear of it? Much of a good thing? Impossible! So someone was speaking to me. I'm Strawberry Shortcake. And I'm Candy Candy Bear. I know, there's too much candy in my name. But it works. There's too much candy in the store. Every hour there are another 10,000 candy canes. Why? Someone flipped the amazing candy cane machine switch and something happened. Amazing candy cane machine? That reminds me of the amazing cookie machine that my friend Ginger invented. I know the perfect gift. But first, I'll need your help. Stop the machine. The world will soon be overrun with candy canes. No, it's wrong, candy candy. Unfortunately, no. Well, I'd be very honored to help you investigate, but I'll need your help. Do you think you can form one of those pyramids? Okay. Allow me 
to baby you with some strawberries. She will love these. You have already done more than enough for us. Allow us to present you with a collection of the world's best candy canes. Oh, thank you very much. This wagon will be perfect for my sister. And I can share these candy canes with all my friends. You don't care about having a present all to yourself? No, honey. In fact, I think I might even like giving gifts more than receiving them. What an idea! I never thought we'd get out of there. I always wondered what too much of a good thing meant. And now I know. I mean, I think I know. That is... Ahem. Look, my sweet pony. We're entering Hollywood's. The Holiday Land Forest. This must be the most gorgeous forest in the world. Oh, I don't know about that. I've seen many other gorgeous forests. Forests of redwoods, of pines, and some ores. Yes, but this one is very incredible. Okay, where do we find a saddle for Angel? Oh, honey, I don't know what Angel would do with a saddle. Why not? Who wouldn't love a saddle? I love saddles. Well, saddles are very nice, but you are a pony. Saddles are good for ponies, but Angel is not a pony. She could be half girl and half pony. I have met creatures like that before in my travels. I know for an answer. What? When she wakes up. I don't know. What does she like? Well, she enjoys sleeping. Then how about a sleeping willow? But that might make her want to sleep more. Aha! Maybe she needs an alarm tree. I don't think so. She gets angry when someone wakes her up. Hmm. This is a tough one. Did I mention that she was a cat? A cat? Well, why didn't you say so? She will need a cat tree. Something that looks like her that she can use for scratching. Are you 
sure the shop is on Carol Lane? Positive. I've been there a million times. Or was it once? But I know it has a bright red door. Or a green one. I hope we find it soon. It's getting pretty dark. <gasps> Gee, 